The following is a quick introduction on the features included in the iCabby dispatch system. This video should be used to complement the dispatch release notes for version 2.2.11, which can be found on the Zendesk portal. The link for this note is detailed in the info section below this video. Editing completed bookings. Editing completed bookings from the bookings tab can be controlled from the staff record. To view completed bookings, click on the bookings tab. Set your date and time if required. Set the status to completed and search. Completed bookings are listed. Click on view. And by default, operators will have the edit option. To disable this edit option, go to the staff record, admin, staff, edit on the staff record, and under dispatch administrator, untick booking edits and save. Turn to the operator screen. Then on the operator screen, Turn to the bookings tab, enter your search criteria, set the status to completed, search. Then when you view a booking, the edit function is now gone. Driver invoice commission. An invoice commission can be set up at the driver level on a generated invoice. When added, the invoice commission will be shown in the charge section on the driver's invoice. To set up a driver invoice commission, Go to Manage, Items, Add Category, name the category Invoice Commission, Save, go to Add Item, Item Ref, Invoice Commission, Item name will all be the same invoice commission. To category, select the invoice commission that you've just set up. No value is necessary. Item type to debit, frequency once, and ensure that no drivers are selected at the bottom. Save on that. The com invoice commission category and item will only need to be set up once. To apply it to the driver record, go to manage drivers, enter the driver reference or name. Then on the far right, the commission setting percentage can be entered 10%. Save. Then when an invoice is generated for the driver, the invoice commission will be shown. To add invoice commission to existing invoices, first remove the invoice and regenerate. Account invoicing additions. The following are additional configurations which can be applied to account invoicing. Account invoice commission. Similarly to a driver invoice, an invoice commission can be applied at the account level. We go to manage accounts, edit on any account, and the settings, invoice commission percentage can be specified. Account invoice discount. The discount can be applied to an account invoice on the account level by going to manage accounts edit on any account in the edit tab scroll down and on the left an invoice discount can be specified account invoice number of passengers the number of passengers can be displayed on the account invoice by going into manage accounts edit on the desirable account, invoice tab, and in the booking fields, passenger PAX. When selected, we'll list the number of passengers. Ensure to save at the bottom, 
This will then apply on all newly generated invoices for this account. Driver panic alert notification. A new setting is available for alerting operators when a driver panic button has been actioned. This can be set in admin, config, settings, general settings, display panic as notice. When set to yes and saved, On the operator screen, a panic button press by any driver will activate the driver panic pop-up, which will, must be actioned by an operator. This will appear on all operator screens until it is actioned. The operator will have the option to take the panic and deal with it, to call the driver directly or to close. The call and close will be activated when an operator takes the panic. By an operator activating the take option, this will close the panic notification on all other operator screens. Zone attribute groups and attribute extras. Attribute groups and attribute extras have been added to the zone level. These can be found in admin, config, zones, zone list, edit on any zone and in the attributes tab when an attribute or an attribute group is applied and saved in this case we will choose R6 and save for this zone Z hold then any addresses in that zone will have that attribute auto populated on the booking form if we return to the booking form, and if we put in an address which is in the Z hold zone, then automatically the R6 attribute is added. Returning to the zone attribute section, the restrict parking option will allow only drivers that match the attribute group set and the attribute extras on their driver and vehicle record to gain a parking position. If the drivers and vehicles do not have those attributes, then they will not get a queue position. Zone colouring. Colouring can be added to bookings by zone on the operator screen. To do this, first set the zone colour, admin, config, zones, zone list, edit on the zone and set the color update zone then set the master color switch for zones in admin config settings general settings group zone by color group zones by color set to yes and save then return to the operator screen and for our zone Z hold you will now see that all bookings in that zone are colored in orange booking priorities Priorities have been added so that now for IV or web and app bookings, priorities can be specified. This can be found in admin, config, settings, booking settings, app, web, and IV or booking priority, which defaults to five, can be individually tailored. When set and a booking comes in, priority will be listed under the P column. Lead time per address. On the address record a lead time modifier can be set. 
Before doing so, we will enter in a test job in the Z hot zone at one Z test address to show the default lead time. be shown with the default 20 minute lead time. To set the lead time modifier on the address record, go to manage addresses, find our address, edit on the address record, lead time modifier on the right can be positive or negative. Let's put that in. 15 minutes and save. Return to the operator screen. Due to database caching, it may take up to five minutes before the change is shown on after making changes to an address record. Load the page. Pre bookings tab. Our original is still there with a default zone lead time of 20 minutes we will book the same pickup address that we have added on 15 minutes same time save We will then see a lead time of 35 minutes, which is 20 minutes of the zone lead time plus the 15 of lead modifier that we set on that particular address record.